Hey, what's going on, guys? This is No Mercy from No Mercy Network, bringing you basically my first uh, mobile device video, my iOS video. I have uh, recorded for quite a while, even maybe two years ago, a year ago, when basically it released a uh, non jailbreaking uh, recording. Um, I had it on my iPod 4, I believe. Yeah, iPod 4, and t it was just too laggy. And now I got my iPhone 6 Plus for quite a while, and I thought, why not make a tutorial on how to get it? Uh, I know it's really known, but for those who don't know it yet and watch my videos or some of them and are interested in recording or something like that, um, yeah, I just want to make a video so you guys know how to get it. Link will be in the description below. It's amu for iOS.net. And if you have iOS 8 or higher, you should use the Shao app. If you have iOS 7 or li lower, it's also uh, iOS 6, you can get the iRack. So uh, I have the shower app, I can hit the install button and uh, tap the install button, but it will uh, it will disappear when I will download it, I just did it. So what you're going to do is basically just go to the get it, install it. Sometimes it will say at the end it won't work or something like that, well that's just bullshit, it, it will work if you just keep trying it again. So sometimes it won't uh, because it's just the downloading from one server and sometimes multiple people are trying to, so uh, it's not always... Uh, uh, in one time dumb so uh, yeah you just download it let me, let me just pause it for now and then you open it up it should look like this you should maybe log in I don't know maybe you should and here you can see your recording as you can see this recording went wrong you tap on it you can do play or open it in another app or save it to your camera roll and that's basically uh, what I always do uh, save it there here you got not really much uh, here you got the download viewer for shout.tv, that's um, something I will be uh, talking about in a few. Uh, the corporate terms of service, privacy policy 8 and so many other stuff. So as you guys see, um, that's basically how you record it. If you want to uh, stream on shout.tv, that's an official app also in the, in the app store. You can hit the start broadcasting button and you can basically... Uh, yeah, broadcast. So let's just go to shout.tv and see here my stream. So these are some of my streams here. I had nine views, seven views. Well, not many, but uh, yeah. That's basically uh, how you stream. You stream on this and people can just tune in like right here. This people is, uh, what is he? He live and trying to do some random Call of Duty. He's recording it with his phone, but you can also record your games, and it basically means you can record all games you want. So for example, um, let me just go to whatever, Pixicon 3D, and this is gonna look weird for you guys since, um, wait, let me just open another app, because it's annoying. If you are, um, let me just open a block hats, because that's a portrait. Uh, Thing. So let's just open this world, and as you guys see, um, I'm just recording my screen right now while gaming. Uh, for as far as I know, it works without any problems. Um, sometimes can happen it will lag out, but not not that those many times, uh, many times. So yeah, here you got the whole world that uh, I kind of worked on with some other people, and yeah. So that's not really important, but uh, one thing is really important, as you guys see, I have my assistive touch on. That's not because my home button is broken or something. No, that's because it otherwise it won't really record your gameplays and you ha will have, uh, yeah, basically just a dark screen. It will look like this, basically. So, uh, yeah. So if you are recording any kind of game, be sure to have your assistive touch on. How do you get your assistive touch on? You go to your settings go back back all the way up go to general accessibility and scroll down to the assistive uh, assistive touch and turn it on as i have and then you can record basically games if you don't want to record games or just something on the internet or something you can do it without but if you want to record games you need this basically um i don't know it's just because of an update for from apple uh, they try to, I don't know what they're really trying to do, but they try to not make it work, but it still does. So for now it works on iOS 8.3. Be sure if, uh, when uh, Apple uh, releases a new update, maybe the iOS 9, which I heard uh, some rumors about, uh, is going to be really hard to do stuff on that. So uh, be sure to wait with the update and watch others uh, if they can do stuff with the new update or not. And so not uh, just wait for a while 
with updating till Xiao makes a uh, patch or something for it. So that was for now guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, I'm just gonna end it right now, and I hope to see you guys in other videos, I hope. Now, that was for now guys, leave a like, comment and subscribe of course, and see you guys in another video, ciao.